All right, what's happening, y'all? Just left Minnesota, landed in Denver. And from Denver, I'm going, going back, back to Cali, Cali. But now I'm just messing with you guys. Yeah, we're heading out to California. I'm heading out to California. One of my boxers is uh, gonna be out there visiting his family. So I told him I'll fly out there and maybe we can get on a couple shows. So honestly, it's just a wing and a prayer. Hopefully we can get on a couple boxing shows out there in LA. But hey, we getting ready to try and get these fights going, man. I talked to a couple of the teams. They still working on it, but uh, wish us luck and wish we even get a fight. If not, we're gonna be kicking it all weekend. I'm out. Talk to y'all soon. What's going on, y'all? We're over here at the Wild Card Boxing Gym in LA, man. I got Derry working out real quick, just getting a quick workout in. That's all. All right, guys. You know, we did not get a fight this weekend, but we ended up having a long four day weekend, kicking it, having some fun. Peep it out. All right, y'all. Back again, man. We out here. <clears throat> See the two buildings behind me? That's where he lives. Right across the street from Staples Center. And we about to ride. To hey man, we about to ride these man, man. scooters. Sure on Facebook and all that stuff. That's what he's building for. So if y'all want to get some of that behind the scene action, make sure y'all follow Ludy on Facebook. What's your Facebook, Ludy? Ludy Webster. Ludy Webster. Yeah. Make sure y'all add him on there. Link yeah. in the description below. So man, here's what's going on. I'm <laughs> eating. <laughs> I got a few of this shit. So this man right here, tall guy, Kyrie, his brothers, that man, they some healthy dudes, man. <laughs> you know, doing these big things out here, man. Living out here in L.A., I run downstairs and grab something to eat, but not these cats, man. They yeah, cook man. their own food. Look at, <laughs> look at this right here, man. We got salmon, <laughs> green beans, and what these things called? Russell sprouts. Russell sprouts. And brown rice. And brown rice. This shit's nasty as hell. <laughs> hey, hey y'all. I'm trying to eat them, man, but... <laughs> it's just, it's just. How's it nasty, bro? Why is it nasty? Man, no That's some good shit. <laughs> no flavor to this shit, man. Hey, you it's guys. healthy, bro. Your own ass needs to be eating healthy. Hey, I'm gonna I'm eat healthy with these guys this week, but man, I want to I want to get back there and get a Juicy Lucy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I ain't gonna lie, nigga. We both want a Juicy Lucy. Here. See, see. But see, that's why I got this. Oh, yeah, see? You know what I'm saying? I'll show you mine, but y'all would laugh. <laughs> All right, I'm out. 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 i am out i all right, what's happening, y'all? I'm over here with uh, Tall Guy Kyrie Review, man. Course, we out here making it happen. With my dog, Ludy, man. Make sure y'all rock with him. Got YouTube channels coming. Got the most coming, man. It's probably legendary, dude. Hey, man, we trying to do the thing out here. But uh, this is it. This is my last night, y'all. We just got out the scooters. I'm about to hop on this flight and head back to Minneapolis and get it in. Talk to y'all when we get there. Legendary. Okay, guys, what's happening? We didn't get anything out there in California. Came back to Minnesota, had about two weeks, and went to the Christy Martin Invitational in North Carolina, and he did his thing. Two on one, bracket, hit one of these rings, get this W. Got two fights. Nice. Great tomorrow. Oh, it's gonna be nice, y'all. Oh, yeah. And they got three rings in here. She set it up. It's the Christy Martin Invitational. Good luck, man. Sitting here being relaxed. Like always. Gotta get it. Gotta get it, baby. For the championship. Attention. You see that, baby? All boxes. Second fight for the championship, baby. And he did his thing. Did his thing. We got him. Say it again. They'll never be seen again, but we got him because yeah. <laughs> they don't got the video. She was recording. Taking pictures. Taking pictures, though. <laughs> hey, we got, we got the win. We did what we were supposed to do. He came out here and put his work in. All right, guys, that was Derry Jones' second belt this year. He won the Upper Midwest Golden Gloves. And then we went to the Christy Martin Invitational. He got a belt there. We had about two weeks to prepare, and then we headed back to California for the Sugar Burt Tournament. In between that time, we fought in Iowa. Got that, uh, so every weekend, I was did his thing. out of town for the guy that putting was a little bit bigger, man. A Check lot bigger out. than him and a little bit heavier, man. But he did what he was supposed to do, in and out, man, lighten him up. All right, guys, we are back in L.A. at the Sugar Bird Tournament. 
I'm uh, waiting for Ludi and Derry to weigh in. There's probably about 500 boxers in this tournament, so hopefully they do their thing. All right. We are at the convention center, Ontario Convention Center. Ludi getting ready for his bout. Got about another hour and a half. I think the show starts here in about a half an hour. All right, guys. Well, as a coach, taking fault on this one, I made a big mistake. So the day before, we watched two guys fight, and the winner of that, Ludi, was supposed to fight. Uh, but come to find out, he didn't. It wasn't either one of them guys, and I made a mistake by watching it. So I take blame on that one. Ludi was kind of shook. He, we had a game plan for the other guy, and we ended up fighting somebody totally different. But you know, you live and you learn. Uh, he came up a little short, but uh, I was proud of him. All right, guys, so now Deary's fighting man doing this thing. He all boxes this dude, moves around. Do what he was supposed to do with movement, was real nice, man. He was kicking the dude with clean shots. He just all boxes him, man. Check it out. All right, guys, we are on a road. Derry is doing his thing out there. Three belts this year, the Upper Midwest Golden Gloves, Christy Martin Invitational, and a Sugar Bird Tournament. So we got three belts, he's on a roll. We took a few photos, then Derry ended up riding off into the sunset with his wife. Me and my family went down to Ecuador. I opened up a gym down there about a year and a half ago. I'm gonna show some clips on that. But stay tuned, we got a lot more. All right, guys, back to training for a few weeks, and then we got two shows down in Iowa back to back. Check it out. All right, guys, he dropped him right there, man, and uh, I get real amped. I know y'all heard me. But anyways, dude came back, man, but Derry did his thing, finished the round real strong, and ended up getting the victory. Everybody give it up. And the winner out of the red corner, Barry Jones. Someone call the police. <laughs> yeah, I didn't get it. Junk in the truck. Junk in the truck. There you go right there, guys. My phone was charged. There you go right there, guys. We came out here to Iowa. First, he put in uh, 12 hours as an officer. Yep. We drove four and a half hours to get here. Yep. He fought, won. Now we're driving back home. Plus, we worked up before I went to work yesterday. Yes, sir. So yes, 10 sir. 10 to 12. 12 to, no, 10 to 12. Had to be a part of it. And that's what we're doing. 2 to 2. Two to two. Then we drove out here. We they understand, one. man. They understand. Hey, that's a lot. We, we, we putting thing. in work. We putting in work, y'all. All right, guys, man. Now we man. went down to Iowa and got our 15th fight in, man. And now he's 15 and 1. But be honest with you, right before all this, man, shit started going south for me and him, man. We weren't seeing eye to eye, man. Camps weren't going that good. He was pretty much undefeated. Cats started coming around. Motherfuckers was talking. But, you know, we worked through it. Uh, we get ready for the Eastern Conference qualifier. We had three weeks to get ready uh, in a sparring session, man. A week into it, man, the brother gets hurt, man. So 
shit really didn't look good for us at all. So he was really, really out of shape when we went down to this Eastern Conference qualifier. All right, guys, so Derry kind of picked this guy apart, man. Every time Derry caught him, man, he would hurt the dude. Um, dude, dude kept coming, had a lot of heart, but I could tell Derry was hurting. You know, his back was bothering him. Because uh, in the second round, man, Derry just pretty much ran out of gas, man, from not working out two weeks before we got there. Uh, luckily, Derry stopped him in the second round, um, did his thing. But I knew if, you know, any other fight, man, you know, these guys' competition is going to just get better. Guys, you can tell right here where Derry kind of just started running out of gas. He's swinging wild. His hands are down. You know, Derry got a lot of heart, man. He ain't going to give up, but, you know, he was out of shape, man. Nothing we can do about it. So that was the end of the first round, man. Luckily, Derry got a little bit more time because the doctor had to check out the dude in the red. He kept, you know, he was getting caught pretty good, man, and getting hurt. But second round came out, and, you know, Derry started catching him and started catching him with some clean shots, um, and the ref ended up stopping it. see man dude wasn't too happy about the stoppage man even at the end he wasn't uh wasn't the, you know poor sports right there but you know it is what it is man Derry got the victory and uh and on going on to the next fight all right out in the audience if you're a boxing fan you definitely know who that is fernando vargas but you know we got a couple pictures and on to the next one First round came, man. Derry moved around as much as he could. Try to outbox the dude. Guy was putting a lot of pressure on him. Like I said, Derry was kind of out of shape, man. If Derry would have been in shape, man, I don't think he would have had a problem with anybody down there. You know, the dude is dude is a beast. And, but, you know, it happened, you know, the way it happened. But he ended up coming up short on this one, man. It was a close fight. All right, guys, we had one more shot. It was called the last chance qualifier for the Olympics. But the way we weren't seeing eye to eye, man, in our luck, it just wasn't meant to be, man. About a week or two into practice, the dude ended up breaking a bone, man, and that was it. That was the end of the run. All right, so I enjoyed the run that we had, man. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give me the thumbs up. Also, subscribe to my channel. Earlier in the video, man, I was talking about Ecuador. I opened up a gym down there, man, about a year and a half ago, two years, man. You guys got to check that out. I got some videos coming up on that. Hit the like button, subscribe. Peace.